Packers, Jets, full pads, three guys with three things. Mike, you are up. Well, Larry, there's a new entrant in the competition for starting guard, and it's rookie fourth round draft pick Royce Newman out of Old Miss. We saw him today against the Jets taking the majority of the snaps at right guard with the number one offensive line. Now, the interesting thing is if Newman is able to land that job, with Josh Myers, the rookie second round pick from Ohio State starting at center, the Packers could go into week one with two rookie draft picks starting on the offensive line for the first time in 15 years. The rougher it gets, the better Newman looks. And Wes, what is your thing? I was over on the other side of the field today between the Jets and Packers, and I got a chance to really get an appreciation for Preston Smith and what he brings to the table. He's a guy that sometimes we don't always talk about, but he's a steady Eddie, and he had a big performance today against Mekhi Becton was really able to cause some havoc in some of those team drills against the Jets. And as this training camp rolls on, Preston Smith looks like he's right where he needs to be to have that bounce back season he wants. All right, gentlemen, I'm going with a play of the day, red zone period just a few minutes ago. Aaron Rodgers looking downfield, not too far downfield, we were in the red zone, but Robert Tunyon covered real well by C.J. Mosley. He's kind of a brand name linebacker, covered real well, and I had the perfect angle the window of opportunity was like microscopic. And so Aaron Rodgers fires a strike and Robert Tunyon a terrific catch. That was the play of the day, in my humble opinion. Anything else for the good of the hole? Well, Larry, we got one more of these things and then obviously get back to it on Saturday night. It's been fun. See you in some more pads. That's three guys with three things. See you next time.